Hey y'all, Jay's Creations Art Sanity here, and for this snowman tumbler, I am starting with a 17 ounce stemless wine glass from Hog um, that I have prepped with a base coat of a matte white. Um, I do have a video showing you how I prep my cups that I will leave linked in here and in the description. Um, also in the description, I will have all of my supplies listed down there and where I got them. So once my base coat was dry, I am now putting on my first layer of epoxy. To that epoxy, I have mixed in some crushed crystal mica powder. Uh, this stuff is super pretty. It's so sparkly. Perfect for a snow base, um, Christmas cups. Uh, or just cups that you want a little extra sparkle to. So I am completely covering my cup with this, uh, making sure that it's good and covered, all smoothed out. And then I will hit it with my torch to get any bubbles. After that, I'll put it on my turner and leave it spinning to completely cure. So while that's curing, I am making a water slide decal for this. I got the image off of Etsy. Like I said, it'll all be in the description below. I printed the image on some water slide paper, sealed it with three coats of Rust-Oleum clear gloss spray, trimmed it all up, and now I'm ready to put it on my cup. This is just room temp water. Once I get my decal on there, I kind of position it to where I want it. Use my finger to push out any excess water from underneath. Make sure I get it all out. There's no air bubbles. It's all laying flat. And I will come in with a paper towel and gently pat it dry. So once I have my decal the way that I want it, I will leave it set um, to completely dry and I am going to put on some um, star snowflake shape glitter. To do that, I am going to coat my cup with Mod Podge. So I'm just going to paint on some Mod Podge here. I'm going to use a jewel picker to pick up my glitter and just randomly place this um, shaped glitter around my cup. I should have had my glitter laid out all ready to go before putting the Mod Podge on because um, it did kind of dry on me. Uh, so not a big deal. Just put a little bit more on and continued with what I was doing. Use my jewel picker to pick up my glitter and just randomly put it around my cup until I have it the way that I want. So once that is done, I leave it to dry and then I'm going to seal in this um, glitter with two coats of Mod Podge before putting on um, my top coat of epoxy. So continue doing this, um, again leaving it dry. So here it is, I'm putting on my um, Mod Podge to seal this in. Like I said, I do two coats, um, waiting for them to dry, and then I put on my top coat of epoxy. I go ahead and do all that off of camera, leave it spinning to fully cure, and get it all cleaned up. And I will come back and show you what the finished cup looks like. Mm -hmm. 
So here's my finished cup. This is a super simple and easy uh, cup to do. Very beginner friendly, but super cute as well. And yeah, so that's it for this one. As always, thank you all so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of this one. And until next time, see ya.